Hey everybody, this is Mr. MathBlog, and this lesson is called Use Place Value to Add. This is lesson 17 in our textbook, and so don't forget all your lessons can be found at uh, www.mrmathblog.com. And so this is third grade, so you'll see a big yellow toolbar when you go to this place right here at the top. Uh, actually, it's a ruler. And then just make sure you pick uh, third grade. So there's fourth grades up there, and you'll see all kinds of other things up there also. Okay, here's our common core strand. and our essential question is how can we use place value uh, to add three digit numbers okay so here's a problem here Melissa and Eric have been saving pennies their whole lives so far Melissa has saved two hundred thirty six dollars in pennies well that's a lot of pennies and Eric saved five hundred eighty five dollars in pennies so he has a lot more pennies so how much uh, have they saved together okay so that's a lot of pennies. So we're going to use place value to add the two add-ins. So we're going to add 236 plus 585. Okay, let's go ahead and estimate, you guys. So we're going to estimate about how many hundreds. 236 is closer to 200 than it is to 300. 585 is closer to 600 than it is to 500. So 200 plus 600 is going to be 800. So it's going to be close to $800. Let's see what we get here. Okay, so I just moved it up there. So step one, we're going to go ahead and add the ones, and we're going to regroup the ones as tens and ones. Okay, so six plus five is eleven. So we're so we're going to regroup it with. Um, uh, we'll put a one up here for the 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 eleven, and put a one down here for the other part of the eleven for the tens and ones. Okay, so here's eleven right here. So 11 right there, okay? All right, and then the next step is we're going to uh, add the tens, okay? So we'll regroup the tens as hundreds and tens. So let's add these tens right here. So 1 plus 3 is 4. 4 plus 8 is 12. So a 2 will go down here for the, for the 2 part on the 12, for the tens part, and then we'll put a 1 up here in the hundreds spot right there, okay? So there's 12, and then... Step three, let's go ahead and add the hundreds, okay? So one plus two is three, plus five is eight. So, so these are going to add up to uh, 821. So let's answer the question. So together, Melissa and Eric have $821. That's a lot of pennies. Okay, so just remember, you guys, uh, to add the regrouped tens and the hundreds. So we added this. Don't forget to add this with the tens that are already here. And don't forget to add this 100 right here with these other hundreds right here. Okay, so just don't forget to, you know, the numbers that we got carried in there. We could also use uh, the commutative property of addition to check our work. So let's change the order of the add-ins and find the sum. So instead of doing 236 plus 585, the commutative property says we can uh, re, um, reorder them 585 plus 236. Okay, let's add the ones right here. Let's go ahead and add the ones and we'll regroup the ones as tens and ones. Okay, so 5 plus 6 is 11. So a 1 goes here and a 1 goes here. Okay, and then we're going to go ahead and add the tens and regroup the tens as hundreds and tens. Okay, so 1 plus 8 is 9 and then 9 plus 3 is 12. So 2 goes down here and a 1 goes up there. Okay, and then we're going to go ahead and add the 100. So 1 plus 5 is 6, plus 2 more is, is 8. So we get 821 and they match up. Okay, the commutative property of addition says that we can do that, no problem. Okay, let's find 563 plus 48 in two ways. Okay, well from the last lesson, you guys, we did the break apart strategy. So the break apart strategy is to break apart 563 as 500 plus 60 plus 3. So 60 is going to go here and 3 is going to go here. 48 is 40 plus 8. So we'll go ahead and put those in there. Okay, and then now we can go ahead and add uh, uh, 500 plus uh, nothing is 500 right there. And then, uh, whoops, and then, uh, and then 60 plus 40 is 100. And then 3 plus uh, 8 is 11. So when we add all those together, we get 500 plus 100 is 600 plus 11 is 611. Okay, and we can also add these using place values. So we'll go ahead and add the ones. 3 plus 8 is 11. Okay, so we'll carry the 1 up there for the 11. And we'll now we'll add the 10s. 1 plus 6 is 7. 7 plus 4 is 11 again. So we'll, uh, uh, we'll go ahead and... 
uh, add those together and carry the one again and then now we'll add the hundreds right here okay so when we add the hundreds we get 611 again okay so they match up in both ways okay all right so let's use place value to add uh, three digit numbers okay let's go ahead and um, uh, estimate you guys so so uh, this is close so these are friendly numbers here we're going to round them to 150 this rounds to 450 and this rounds to 300 okay 150 plus 450 Let's see, it's 550 plus 50 more, 600, so 600 plus 300, we're going to estimate it, estimate it to be come to around 900. Okay, well let's go ahead and add the ones together, okay? So we know it's going to be somewhere close to 900, so 0 plus 7 plus 1 is 8. Okay, let's add the tens here, so then uh, 4 plus 5 is 9, plus 0 is 9. Okay, and let's add the hundreds now. So 1 plus 4 is uh, 5, plus 3 is 8, so we get 898, okay? So that's pretty darn close to, to 900 right there. So 140 plus 457 plus 301 is 898, okay? Uh, let's use place value to add the three add-ins again, okay? So well, let's estimate, you guys, this is closest to 200. This is closest to 100, and this is closest to 300, okay? We're just rounding these to the hundreds. So 200 plus 100 is 300, plus 300 is 600. So we're going to get close to 600. Okay, let's add the ones, and here we'll have to regroup the ones as tens and ones because um, uh, we have to do some carryover. So this is over 10. 3 plus uh, 2 is 5, plus 3 is 13. So the 1 will go up here for the 13, and the 3 will go down here, okay? All right, and then we're going to go ahead and uh, add the 10s, and we're going to regroup the 10s as 100s this time, and 10s. 7 plus, or 1 plus 7 is 8, plus 2 is 10, so a 0 goes down here, and we'll carry the 1 right up there, okay? And then we'll go ahead and add the 100s, okay? So 1, whoops, I didn't mean to do that, let's go back, so... Uh, 1 plus 1 is 2, plus uh, 1 is 3, plus 3 more is going to be 603. Okay, and that's pretty close to 600. So uh, 173 plus 102 plus 328 adds up to 603. And check it out, it's really close to our estimate right up there. All right, you guys, I hope that lesson makes sense. And take care.